Imagine if you were hired for a project to spend billions of dollars on a huge sewer that can collect every drop of used water for recycling. It's going to take decades, and most people will never even see your work. This is the story of Singapore's deep tunnel sewerage system. By the 1990s, Singapore was flourishing, but a growing population meant more used water. Then in 1995, the idea for the DTSS was born. When I was the Director of Environmental Engineering Division, I received a project proposal from the Silverage Department wanting to lay a large pipe to discharge the effluent water from Kim Chuan Sewage Treatment Works all the way south to the East Coast. I did not like the idea, so I thought over the problem and came up with this idea of the DTSS. Why don't I relocate the treatment works at a point very near the sea? Then my discharge of the effluent is very short. And if I lay a pipe that is big enough and deep enough, it can take care of all the wastewater in Singapore. It is really an engineering marvel because we are able to collect the used water and send it to a very centralised plant that is based on a new design concept which is very compact that is able to save land for Singapore. The first phase of the DTSS took nine years and was completed in 2008. It conveys used water from the northern part to the eastern part of Singapore and lies up to 25 storeys beneath our feet. If you look at this project, right, it's stretched out nearly 10 years. And during that period, environment change, site conditions change, business environment change. The contractors, consultants, subcontractors, we were able to get the buy-in for them to change their plans and yet keep to the purpose. In my working life, I can safely say the greatest satisfaction is being involved in DTSS Phase 1 and seeing its fruitful completion. With rising population and industry development, it is not possible to keep expanding existing used water infrastructure. The DTSS is a sustainable solution that will also add greater resilience to our water supply. Phase 2 of the DTSS, together with the Tuas Water Reclamation Plant, is ongoing and will serve the western part of Singapore. We have a network of link sewers that conveys flow to the deep tunnels and to the new Tuas Water Reclamation Plant where it is treated and purified into new water. TWRP will be co-located with NEA's Integrated Waste Management Facility. Collectively, they will be known as the Tuas Nexus, which will facilitate Singapore's harnessing of the water, energy and waste nexus. I feel honoured and challenged and excited to come to work every day, even though it's been 25 years. We have formed a DTSS family where we're all working towards the common goal, which is delivering a sustainable solution for Singapore's water needs. Well, I take great pride in having uh, contributed the DTSS because it is something that would be very beneficial for the nation and would last for the next 100 years. So the next time you're jogging in the park or on your commute to work, remember that an engineering marvel lies just beneath your feet. After all, the most innovative of ideas can sometimes operate in the quietest of ways.